The new at 11, a big cruise ship causing big concerns for the owners of a waterfront home. The ship on an apparent collision course with their house, and they caught all of it on camera. Local 10's Victor of Kendo live tonight in Fort Lauderdale. Victor. Lori, this couple says that they are used to seeing these ships pass right in front of their home, and they normally get a kick out of it. But on Friday, they say that the celebrity Equinox got a little too close for comfort. Too close, get out! Panic and disbelief. I looked up and all I could see was the bow of the vessel and it was towering over the house. Bill Tonhunter looks over Port Everglades from his backyard. Cruise ships regularly pass by, but he says this was a first. We've been here for six years. We've never seen anything like that. We've never seen anything that close. Last Friday evening, Celebrity Cruise's Equinox ship was heading out of Port Everglades when Todd Hunter says it got within 100 feet of his home. When the cruise ship's thrusters stopped, there was silence and I yelled, somebody's going to get fired and everybody on the cruise ship started applauding. In a statement, Celebrity Cruises said as Equinox departed on Friday, March 3rd, she was in her assigned channel at all times under the guidance of specialized local port pilots. The ship operated safely and did not put guests or crew at risk. We can also confirm the ship did not touch bottom. After hearing that statement, what do you say? Um, definitely not. Bill researched the Equinox online and found the ship's info. So you know that there's 25 feet of ship below the waterline. And so it's obviously touching bottom. Todd Hunter says the ship used its thrusters and eventually backed out and took off. To say it's in the proper channel is, is a bogus statement. We also reached out to Port Everglades tonight. They want to stress that the ship did not go off course. Bill has also reached out to the Coast Guard so that they can start a full investigation. In Fort Lauderdale tonight, I'm Victor Okendo, Local 10 News.